horse here. We're about to go. What's that noise? Tell me. Put me to sleep. Ready to go. Ready to go. Maybe we'll get some start getting some real sleep. What you think? Yay! We gonna left or strike? Bye y'all. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Yeah. In she goes. tore that up. Woo, she was hungry. So I ate that and Taylor un the baby ate unloaded that. the car. The baby ate all that. Well, she didn't eat it because she's now not in my tummy. Look at this little angel. Look at the little angel. We want to show her her room. Oh. Are you ready to show her her Yeah, let's go show her her beautiful ballerina princess, princess Jesus room. eyes aren't open but I hope you like it. And look, now we can show her her Mary Marin pillow and her beautiful little pillow with her monogram on it. Because you have a princess name because you're a sweet princess. Do you love it in here? Okay, so if you don't love it then say I don't love it. Okay, let's see. She loves it. She says Guys, she loves it. She didn't tell us she didn't. That's really sweet of her. Oh my gosh. I spend a lot of time on it. Okay, here. Okay. Oh, should we show her all her clothes? Yeah. Show oh, she'll freak out. Okay. If you <laughs> hate the clothes, then scream and tell us you hate them. Oh, she loves them. We're in the clear. <laughs> oh my goodness. I knew you love them, girl. You're just loving everything. <laughs> Okay. If daddy's your favorite, then this is what you're gonna do. They're gonna say, if if mommy's your favorite, then say, mommy is my favorite, and say it clear so we understand. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I guess she's. I guess you're her favorite. I mean, she's how the cookie crumbles. <laughs> Let's show her mommy and daddy's bedroom. This is gonna be her bedroom. <laughs> this is gonna be her bedroom for a little while. She's gonna sleep. With There's her forever. stuff. There's her bassinet. She ain't gonna sleep in that little bassinet right there. Cause she's an angel. Angel baby. Can't believe we're home. This is so fun. This is so fun. I can't stop kissing her. Let's change her outfit. Okay, we just, I just fed her. So now she's just chilling. She'll probably just get up again in a few minutes and decide she wants some more. But Taylor's about to get in the shower, right? Yeah. Yeah, Taylor's stinky. He, he's I, little... I swear I haven't bathed in like four days, three days, something like that. You have though. You showered. Oh, once. Once. But we're about to all kind of lay down because we're tired. We have been like nonstop. And that I feel like that's all first time parents. But yeah, I mean, it is. It's, a big, it's like a big, ch it's new to us. So yeah. it's just like, wow. So. Yeah. But we want to have time with her to just lay down and just stare at how beautiful she is. So. Soak it up. Pick up the camera in just a little bit. Okay, well, guess what? It is not the same day anymore. It's now Sunday. Sunday. Which is the end of the week. So we were filming on Tuesday, the day we brought her home. And now it's Sunday, so tomorrow she'll be a week old. It has been a busy, busy week. A week old? I'm gonna cry. Our friends just had their baby, like, feels like just yesterday. And she just turned a month old. And I was like, no way. 
Like, oh my gosh. So, yeah, anyways. Yeah, crazy. But she's so sweet. We've got a solid two hours of sleep yeah. in the week. <laughs> um, but every bit of that was worth it, like not sleeping. Yeah. So We wanted to kind of just sit down and give you guys some updates since it has been a week on like everything that's been going on and how our first week has gone with her. So, to start off, we went to, the day after we left the hospital, we went to her first pediatrician appointment mm -hmm. or doctor's appointment and we didn't really have any concerns i don't think at the time a little bit of spit up yeah well, spit that's up. what it was a little yeah. bit of spit up like it was like a lot it wasn't just like a normal little amount of spit up yeah so. so so i guess that was a concern so anyways they weighed her and she was down weight which we know is normal in the beginning yeah like she lost some weight in the hospital but then she lost a little bit more weight yeah. um and they were like it was too much so so basically they sent us home with formula and said that we need to substitute a little bit because stuff may not be producing enough or maybe it's too hard to come out right now she was um, using too much energy to get out right getting too much air in her mouth which is then making her spit up right and stuff so we tried the formula and it was like she was projectile vomiting all across the room she, she did not like tolerate it. that at all so Soph started pumping her own yeah. um breast milk and then we started um so started pumping it and giving it to her in a bottle because obviously something about like like she was latching but it was just too hard for her to get it out yeah. obviously so yeah started giving it to her in a bottle and then we went back two days later what friday yeah they said come back friday and we'll check her weight so we went back friday and it was up a lot um back to where she was from when she lost weight in the hospital yeah so that was good and then they were like okay we'll have you come back oh and then that, at that appointment they said she looks a little bit jaundice yeah. and so so that just means she has yellow yellowing of the skin um, and that's caused from increased levels in the bilirubin yeah um, and a lot of babies get it like we were expecting her to probably have a little bit um, and they test you for it they tested her for it in the hospital but she like passed but I feel like I think she only passed by like a little bit and yeah. so they sent us home they didn't make a stay or anything so we found out we had to go get her heel pricked again because that's how they check they have to get the blood and they take it from her heel which so sad don't recommend well yeah no. <laughs> not that i don't she, recommend. she doesn't recommend it at all <laughs> yeah and she actually does so good yeah. this is such a good baby she does not like cry a she, whole lot like no. anything she's um, just chilling she's just chilling look at the baby we finally so oh big. also we finally got her to take a one specific passy and it's the dr brown passy because it matches her bottle so i guess that's the only thing she'll take um but anyways got her heel pricked they called us back and her jaundice was pretty high like it's pretty close to the number where they'd want you to go sit under the lights back in the hospital like admit you back to the hospital for like 24 48 hours whatever and if you don't know sitting under the lights i, I assume the uv rays help decrease the bilirubin yeah. in the blood i'm not sure the science behind that but that's... they need sunlight babies don't get their sunlight yeah so yeah <laughs> thanks so... for telling us the science that cleared <laughs> i thought that yeah. uh. <laughs> but anyways sorry guys let me turn the tv off it's yeah make us look purple but they were like let's just keep an eye on her and we're actually going to go back this coming up tuesday to check and see if it's gotten any better um we can look at her and honestly she looks better today yeah um we've been sitting by the window that's like something and, we really recommend sit by the window with and we light. went they weren't like it wasn't like a huge concern at all yeah they so, would have like done something else yeah if, it, it wasn't like a huge concern they said as long as she's eating normal normal amounts poopy diapers. she's pooping pooping poopy. and peeing stink stink and pee pee <laughs> um tt tt guys what do you comment below what you call it it's tt and poo poo is it is it stink stink no or she's she don't stink. She's a princess. Oh, okay. Comment below <laughs> what you what you call it. Um, um, but that's how she excretes the excess bilirubin out of her body is through bowel movement. So they said just monitor all of that. If that doesn't change, then there should be no concerns. And um, she's doing great. Oh, she those, is doing phenomenal. On those diapers. She's taken right after her mama. <laughs> Stop saying that. You're making that up. We get so excited when she goes to the bathroom. It's like an announcement. Like, I'll be in the other room. He's like, she's going. I, I do for you, too. Yeah. Wait, <laughs> what? I didn't know that's what you said. She said it. Told you I wasn't lying. Can you stop? Anyways, so that's kind of the update there. So here in two days, we will go check on her, make sure she's all good. But seriously, she's fine. Like, everything's fine. She's just so so cute and, and, and at this point when we're filming this right now no one knows her name at the moment but by the time you're watching this mm -hmm. you know this is sweet mary marin mary marin 
sweet man. Right. Yeah, it's actually funny. Right now it is 3.13 p.m. on Sunday, November 26th. We're announcing it in less than an hour. So right now, this very moment, no one knows the name, but you guys obviously know by now. Mary Marin, our perfect little angel. We keep going places and everyone calls her Mary because they just think Marin's her middle name. And it is, but like... It's a double name. It's Mary Marin. It's a double name. So... Mary Marin. If you Mary. see us, you say... Mary Marin. <laughs> Just, you guys know that, okay? Mary Marin. Y'all say Mary, I'm like, who? Where's she at? Who's <laughs> Mary? But anyways, that's our little update, and the first week has been seriously the best. We're finally starting to, like, figure some things out with Getting sleeping. A, a good routine. Last night was probably the first night yes, we've gotten yeah. sleep. Yeah. We, we, we have been super stressed though. I feel like that has come with it like we didn't want to lay her down because when she would lay down flat one She doesn't like it Two, It makes her spit up. Yeah, and then you're so, not supposed to lay them at an incline so. Yeah, there's like so we so are literally <laughs> staying up like, all night long every We would be second. in shifts every two hours. She'd go to sleep for two hours. I'd wake up for two hours Yeah, you know and then vice versa And then we'd both stay up sometimes too. Both together. stay up. It, it was crazy. It was very different. Not sustainable <laughs> But and we knew that wasn't gonna be forever We just were like we want to get this figured out first and we finally got the whole spit up yeah. situation under control So anyways, that's our update. We are thankful for each and every one of you We are thankful for our Lord and Savior Jesus. We are thankful for our beautiful angel and anyways we love you guys, we love Jesus, and we'll catch you guys in the next vid. Taylor and Soph, out.